Oh, shit. Sulik is dead. God damn it. Fuck, why is it so fucking hard to get to Fault City? Without something like this happening. Jesus Christ. Welcome back to another edition of Retro Gaming Monday. Today we're, today we're going to be picking up where we left off in Fallout 2. I believe we just stopped in in this tiny little town. So let's check it out, see what's there. Maybe we'll make it to Fault City. Let's just see what this game has in store for us today. Either way, thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment, ring the bell, all that good stuff. And let's get started. Okay. So it is night. So some people not... So some people might not like us being here at this time. But let's see, anyway, what all there is here. An average person of average height of average complexion, nothing out of the ordinary. Hmm. Sorry, this trading post is closed indefinitely due to the drought. Uh, I'm new here. What can you tell me about this town? Well then, welcome to Modoc. My name's Joe and I run this here trading post. We don't have much, just a few farms, a slaughterhouse, Rose's bed and breakfast, and a tannery. Uh, just enough to produce goods to trade, although that could change with this drought. Hmm. Uh, what can you tell me about the Slaughterhouse? Slaughterhouse is run by Grisham and his son Davin. Uh, it's just east of here. He makes the best damn jerky this side of the Rockies. Rose's Bed and Breakfast? Rose's Bed and Breakfast is on the north side of town. Travelers from all over come just to sample her world-famous omelets. Some say her omelets can cure people of what ails them. Uh, frankly, I think that's just a bunch of nonsense. Tell me about the trading post. Like I said before, my name's Joe and I run the trading post from, from Modoc. I organize trade between Modoc and other cities in need of food and leather goods. But with this drought, that could all come to an end real soon. We're getting desperate. Where's the tannery? Just follow your nose and you'll find it. Can you smell that foul stench in the air? That's the tanning vats uh, just north of here. If you overlook the smell, you'll not find a better place to get leather goods. Balthus can work miracles with leather. Hmm. What's that white building in the middle of town? Oh, that's our town church. The people of Modoc built it to show their faith. Lately, there hasn't been much to be thankful for, so nobody attends the sermons anymore. Huh ask you a few more questions what can i do for you i'm looking for a certain item and i was wondering if you might be able to help me locate it we'll spit it out i can't help you if you don't tell me what you're looking for i sure ain't gonna stand here and try to guess what you're looking for i'm looking for the holy geck well you're in luck i just happen to know where it is i guess we have some business to discuss after all hmm Business, just tell me where I can find the Holy Geck and I'll be on my way. Or our location, our only business is that you'll tell me where the Holy Geck is located before something bad happens. Okay, not going with that one. Let's go with this first one. Uh, yep, that's the one big chip on your shoulder. Why don't you come back when that chip isn't quite so big? You have a nice day and watch out for that door on the way out. Oh, okay, apparently he didn't like that one either. Uh, know where I might find it. What do you want for this information? Ah, yes, what I want. If you hadn't noticed yet, our little farming community is experiencing one of its worst droughts ever. The rainy season was unusually short this year, and our crops are dead or dying from the lack of water. To put it bluntly, our community is on the verge of withering away with our crops. Um, you do know I can't make it rain, right? He chuckles softly. No, no, of course not. I wouldn't ask you to do something as impossible as that. You really can't make it rain, can you? No, of course you can't. Anyway, like I was saying, we're in trouble and we could use your help. Okay, I'm listening. There's this farm at the outskirts of town where no farm should be. Some years back, it just appeared out of nowhere. Are you saying that this farm sprung up overnight? Yeah, right. A group of us were out hunting when we noticed the new farm. But that wasn't the strange thing. Soon after, some of us got together to visit our new neighbor, only to discover that there wasn't anybody there. Go on. After many months of trying to contact the owners with no success, it was decided that the farm must have been abandoned soon after it was built. So instead of letting the crop rot, the crops rot in the field, young Carl moved in. Hmm. 
That's when things got bad. Carl started to tell stories of seeing strange glowing figures tending the crops and feeding the animals at night. We all laughed at him, thinking he was making up stories. Then one day, Carl stopped coming into town. What happened to him? Did you look for him? Of course we did. We went up there as soon as we suspected something was wrong. He starts to tremble violently. The horror. Bodies strewn everywhere. Some crucified while others were left to rot out uh, uh, in the sun. I still wake up screaming in the middle of the night from the horrible images I saw that day. So let me guess, you want me to go to this farm and find out what happened? Normally I would just leave that cursed place be, but for some reason the crops at this farm are still flourishing despite the drought. We'll starve if we don't get food soon. Will you help us rid the farm of these ghosts? Uh, what do I get out of this? In return for helping us, I'll tell you where you can find what you seek. <laughs> okay, then let's seal the deal. Cut off your right pinky finger. <laughs> as funny as that would be, I'd probably go with the second one. Uh, then it's a deal. Show me where this ghost farm is. This farm is about a day's travel northeast of here. He pulls out a map and points to a spot northeast of Modoc. Come back when you found something. Goodbye. Okay. Let me see here. Oh. Okay, shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. Okay, I'm actually not supposed to take this quest yet. It has a very tight time limit. Okay, so let me reload. Sorry about all that. Um, <laughs> I didn't realize I'm trying to follow this guide to make sure I don't fuck up anything too much. And uh, just realized I was about to, so let's try something else then. Let's uh, head into this church. See a townsperson. Even the wells have gone dry. Okay. See a sink. All right. Apparently that sink does nothing. Yeah, it sure is. Uh, sure is in a drought, huh? See the well. Okay. Let's go to this well. Ooh, okay. Broke it open. Am I about to go down it? Nope, okay. Just, uh, just busted it open, apparently. Huh. Alright, here, let me do something then. Let me... Let's make it morning, then. Now let's go talk to people. I'm sure they'll be much more willing to talk to us in the morning, or during daytime, than at night. Okay, who's this? A very active old man. Alright, let's talk to him. Name's Grisham. Welcome to my slaughterhouse. You dropping off or picking up? I guess picking up. I'm interested in buying some traveling provisions. Ah, of course, of course. Let's see, for traveling, I would recommend our world-famous dried Brahmin strips. Won't spoil on the road, and it's tasty too. Only $10 a package, you interested? Can I ask you a few more questions? What can I do for you now? I could buy some of your famous jerky. Can you tell me a little bit about the slaughterhouse? The drought hasn't affected your business yet. Alright, slaughterhouse. Not much to tell. I run the slaughterhouse in Modoc. You want something slaughtered? You bring it to me. I'll kill it for you and make it into some of the best jerky you've ever tasted. What about the hides and other parts of the animal? You are quick, aren't you? Well, if you ask, you can retrieve any part of the animal you want. Balthus will usually buy the hides and Rose will buy whatever scraps you don't want. She uses it to make soup and feed her dogs. Hmm. A few more questions. Uh, actually, it, ha it has kind of helped my business. Nobody has been able to grow sufficient food for their Brahmin, so they are severely culling their herds. Uh, but that's just a temporary thing. You have to look at the big picture. With the decline in the Brahmin population, my business can only suffer. Huh. Alright, let's go ahead and barter with him. 
Yep, just some uh, just some jerky, huh? Yeah, that's right. I got a Brock flower, a shotgun, shovel, psycho. How much does the psycho go for? Four hundred. Okay, yeah. All right. He doesn't have anything I'm really interested in. Bye. What? You look like a capable traveler. I don't suppose you'd be interested in making some money. Uh, sure. Great. Head out to the pastures at night and kill the pack of wild dogs that are attacking my brahmin. Come back here when you finish the job. Okay. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, shit, they are coming. Uh. Shit, I was not prepared for this. <laughs> oh, shit. Shit. Oh, God. That's... This is not good. Okay. Okay, please tell me my companions are going to get involved in this as well. Otherwise, this is not going to be good. Okay, alright, thank god they are getting involved. Oh shit, that Brahmin's about to get fucked up. Oh shit, they're all ganging up on that one, huh? Wait, why did they get another... What? Okay. Oh my god, fucking... Shit. Oh god, this is not looking good. Okay, I'm gonna do this. <laughs> I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna reload again. I'm so sorry. Um, I promise not to make that a habit. I am just very flustered. <laughs> so let me go and get this out. And here, let me see if I can just be talking to people um, at night. Alright. James Grisham. Okay. Your questions. That. All that. You're out. Okay. Right. Bye. Sure. End. All right, there we go. Okay, okay. We're looking good. Okay. There. Now, hopefully, they'll go after me more than the Brahmin. All right, that one I shot is running away. That's good. Okay, all right, now come my companions. Ah, shit, they're all going for that one Brahmin. Okay. 
Okay. Alright. Ramen are just trying to move about, I see. Why the hell is this one walking into the wolves? What? Okay, this that one Brahmin is a dumbass, apparently. Good to know. Oh shit, they're heading into the middle of it all. Oh shit, these dogs be causing chaos, huh? Shit. Oh shit. That is really not good. And this is out of ammo, huh? Twenty-five percent, twenty-nine, eleven. Oof. It's not looking good. They're walking here. 29. Oh, uh, shit. Ooh, this is really not looking good. All right, I'm going to try. Okay, thank God. Whew. Oh, God. Yeah, this is a... Uh... This is not looking good, huh? If only my companions could help. They seem to just be running around, running amok. Oh god, they're surrounding that one. Why'd you shoot the Brahmin? You fucking idiot! Ah, oh, god damn it! Of course, I accidentally hit Sulik. Man, now I'm a dumbass too. Fuck. Yeah, this ain't looking good, huh? Shit. Yeah, get out of there, Brahmin. Alright, hey hey. There we go. Now that one's running away too. Not looking too good for this poor Brahmin, unfortunately. Uh... Okay. Alright, let's see now. Minus 7, minus 21. Oof. Yeah, that is... None of that is looking good, huh? Okay, best thing I can do is just walk forward a bit, huh? Oh, this poor Brahmin. Hmm. Ah, shit. That one's dead. Okay. Alright, okay. Well, hey, if they come after me, that means only one is dead. Or one will have died. Alright, anyway, I can... Nope. Alright. Just gonna have to pull out this strategy. Yeah, there you go, Sulik. All right. 
right. Thanks, Vic, as well. But you missed. So, not great. And now they have me surrounded. Cool. Awesome. Sweet. And I can't get into my inventory. All right. So, I'm stuck. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Man, these dogs are tough. Alright, my hit points are not looking great. Thankfully, most of them seem to be missing. That's good, at least. Okay, alright, it's my turn. So, first of all, let's reload that. Also, reload this. Nope, apparently I can't reload that. And... Let's... So grab... A stim pack. And use it. Okay. And I still can't move anywhere. Cool. Okay. Yep, and okay, all right. No choice. Okay. All right, gonna need to heal up again, huh? Alright, good to know that, uh... Alright, hey, though, I've got enough AP left to actually shoot one of these. Okay. Alright, they seem to be missing. That's good, that's good, that's good. Of course, you miss again, Vic. Thank you so much for that, huh? Let me go ahead and heal again. All the healing's good. And I'll shoot this one again. God damn, these have a lot of hit points, apparently. Alright, that one's just running away, so that's okay. God, you suck with that, Vic. <laughs> you suck with that. Shit, this is out of... God damn it. Alright. Okay, and I'll heal myself again. Switch back to this. Call it a turn. Alright. Hey, hey! Oh, and missed and lost his next turn. Good. Hey, you actually hit one, Vic! Well, not the one you were aiming for, but still, you hit it. Good job. Way to go, buddy. All right, one down. Hallelujah. Let's take a couple steps out of here, huh? Hey, way to go, Vic. You actually killed something. Nice. All right. There goes another one. Damn, that one slid hella far. Oh, and it's dead, too. All right. Good, good, good. Now let me reload once again. All right. 
Last two. Shotgun shells. Let's make them count. Let's see, can I hit it from here? Hmm. Maybe it's a stretch. Make sure I get a real good shot on it. Oh shit, now it's running away. Okay, maybe it's better if I just switch to the pistol. Oh shit, I got it, hell yeah. All right, just have these five to deal with, it looks like. They are not going to let us get close, huh? 3%, 7%, take two steps, 15. Missed. Oh well. Man, I need a longer range gun, don't I? Missed again. All right. Owen's running. Damn, yeah, they will literally not let us get close. Hey, got one. Not bad. Minus 1%, 7%, 19. Miss. Damn it. Twenty-seven. I'll take it. Hey hey, got it. Nice. Seven percent. Fifteen. Hey hey, shit! I ain't doing too bad with this pistol now, huh? Seven. Ah. Got a little cocky there, but oh well. Let's try again. Nope, out of ammo. Alright. Well then. There we go. Reload with some better bullets. Okay. Ah, shit, it's running again. God damn it. Alright. 9%. Miss. Eleven damn it again. Wish I could wish I could just count as God damn it. Like getting scared away. Okay, didn't run too far this time. Seven percent. Alright, thank God, okay. The the aim gods were on my side this time. Alright, just one left. Huh. This one cow is just following us around, huh? See, negative twenty-five percent. Okay, never mind. All right, 
right, how about now? 3%, okay. Let's take the two steps forward and try it out. 11. Miss. Damn. Four, two, okay. 19. Hey, I hit it. That's good. Now it's running again, of course. All right, thank God it's not running anymore. Okay, 23. Shit, of course I miss. And it's running again, of course. Damn, this cow is just all about us, huh? Right. Come on, don't be running anymore, dog. Damn it. Shit. Okay. Alright, time to go back to the old two step spray and pray. Not spray and pray, but aim and pray, I guess. Seven. Damn it. Okay. All right. Maybe this time. Fifteen. Damn it. Now it's wasting bullets, but also, like, I don't want to feel like my turn is being wasted because I take two steps and stop. Nineteen. All right. Got it. Thank God. Is there anything else? Nope, I think that is it. Woo! Alright. <laughs> Boss, who leaks glaring at me again? Woo! Okay, 600 XP. That's good. That's pretty damn good. All right, reload that. Go and put this away. All right, now let's I check the bodies at all. Don't seem like it. Uh, pains of a wild dog. Yeah. Nope, won't let me get anything from their bodies. But hey, we did it, so we can go back and report some good news. His name is Bess. Aww. I knew you'd be able to handle it. Let's see now. I owe you 1,000 for completing the job. Of course, one Brahmin got killed. Due to your carelessness, $100 per Brahmin, your reward is $900. do not even bother to lie about the number of Brahmin killed. I had one of my boys follow you out and watch from a distance. Okay, you know what? That's fair. That's fair. Why, <laughs> you never said anything about charging me if Brahmin died. Why, you conniving dried up old coot. Arg! Mark my words, this is the last time you get the best of me. Nah, you know what? Thanks, Pops. Pleasure doing business with you. Woo! 900 is 900 holy shit that's good man i am rich now yeah i should have over a thousand dollars now yeah i do 1015 holy shit that's good all right oh you're vic okay all right. Oh my, a very shapely and seductive looking woman. Whoo! <laughs> well, hello there, strange stranger. I'm Maria. Uh, what do you do around here? 
Why me? I do odd jobs here and there. Surely nothing worth talking about. She flutters her eyes at you. Hmm. <laughs> You're right. Enough talk. Let's get, let's get it on. You know you want it. Oh, God. I really would like to know more about you. All right. I'm going to be a fucking simp. Let's do it. I'm really touched. Nobody ever tries to get to know me better. <gasps> Holy shit, does simping work? <gasps> all they want is sex, sex, sex. I get so tired of having wild sex all the time. I'm so glad you're not like the others. You slut, I thought you were special for a moment. <laughs> yeah, and we're not going the fucking incel route, so... uh. You know, I'm just a normal guy like everyone else. Why my friends say, biggest dickus, you're just so cool because you're normal, just like everyone else. Yep, normal, that's me. <laughs> well, I've never known anyone as interesting as you are. Uh, let's go for this one. She blushes. Stop, you're embarrassing me. You're just the sweetest thing. Why don't you come over here and sit by me? Uh... You are a slut, aren't you? <laughs> Alright, you know what I want, baby. I think that's going too far. Can we just talk? Uh, let's, uh, let's try the second option. Ah, shit! Damn it! Damn it! Fuck! I fucked it up! Damn it! Fuck! Fuck! Okay, well, that's what I get for trying to do that. All right, can I ask you a few more questions? Okay, damn it. I would reload just for that, but then I'd have to redo that whole Brahmin thing over again, and I'm not interested. Hello, my name's Davin. I help my father run the slaughterhouse in Modoc. Uh, what do you do at the slaughterhouse? Well, I, uh, I mean, I supervise and take care of stuff. I'm the owner's son, after all. I'm going to inherit this place when my dad kicks off. Ask you a few more questions. Heard rumors about you and the Brahmin. Wait, what? It's a lie. I go out to the barn at night to, uh, make sure everything is locked up, you know, with all the wild animals running around. Oh! <laughs> so, uh, there's rumors about him and the Brahmin, huh? <laughs> Uh, tell me about your dad. Dad runs the slaughterhouse. He's okay as far as fathers go. A word of advice if you do any business with him. There's usually more to his business deals than he lets on. Ah, uh, yes. I've come to know that. I'm sorry, wait, what now? Why don't we get more comfortable? Hmm? Well, shit, never hurts to ask. Wow, I never thought such a beautiful woman would try to seduce me. What? You're not a woman. Don't worry. You're so pretty. I won't say anything if you won't. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Doing this gay shit, huh? All right. Let's go for it. Uh, to look into your eyes is sheer heaven. Let us not break the spell of this previous moment with words. Let our actions speak for themselves. Stop talking. You're going to ruin it for the both of us. Just sit back and enjoy. <laughs> there must be a mistake. I just wanted to ask you some questions. Thanks for the offer, but no, uh, I'll be leaving now. <sighs> you know what? Fuck it, let's do this gay shit. Let's go with this first one. Giggles. I'm Caboose. <laughs> you can be it the next time. Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> so, uh... So wait a second. The caboose is the back of the train. So is... Does that mean that he's getting behind me? Or does that mean he's taking it from behind? I'm kind of confused. But either... I mean, you can be it next time. Sounds like... Like, I'm getting behind kind of talk. It sounds like, hey, I'm the one that's getting the good stuff okay continue half an hour later you're you lie there exhausted half an hour that's a that's a bit generous if i mean let's be honest it would be like 30 seconds uh if the, if this guy is fucking brahmin he's 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 probably kind of desperate and would be done quickly 
what's going on in here? <laughs> Dad, uh-oh. <laughs> Uh, holy shit, I knew Davin was different, but there's only one way to make this right. Uh, okay. Boy, don't even try to explain this. I don't want to hear it. I'm gonna get the preacher, make this all lawful-like. You will leave and take my son with you when you go. Oh! Oh! He's making us get married, huh? Okay... Are we dearly beloved, we are gathered here. Uh, Joe, can we skip to the Vi help hours? Okay, um, before we begin, is there anyone in this room? Uh, no, any reason why these two should not be joined? Uh, <laughs> boy, <laughs> uh, continue, please. <laughs> Do you, biggest dickest, take Davin to flee your lawfully weathered, uh, other? Yes. I sure the hell. Don't make me make Davin a widower. <laughs> um, I do. <laughs> do you, Davin, take biggest dickest to be your lovely weathered other? <laughs> I sure the do. <laughs> then by frontier law, I pronounce you attached. You may now kiss the other. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Joe turns some pages in his books. Okay, then. Wow. What can I do for you, lover boy? <laughs> oh, he's a companion now. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow, I got fucking shotgun weddinged. <laughs> Man, just we're just two dudes out here in the wasteland. Just, uh... You know, just having a good old time. <laughs> okay, alright. Well, hey. Got a companion now. Uh, let's see. Well, let's, uh, let's keep on exploring then, after all that business. Where are you going to? I'm trying to talk to you. What can I do for you? Oh, yes. Um, <laughs> that's right. I'm here on a quest. <laughs> Looking for a certain item, and I was wondering if you might be able to help me locate it. Spit it out, looking... Oh, wait, this is Joe. That's right, never mind. I don't want to talk to him about it yet. Man, he runs fucking wild-like. Okay. Well, uh... Now that you're my sister-in-law, is there a way I can talk to you now? That's just sick. Oh, Jesus, I didn't know you were a bigot. All right. Never mind then. I don't want to talk to you. Moo. Poor this poor Brahmin is injured. Oh, can we heal it? Uh doctor maybe? You failed to heal the Brahmin's broken leg. Ah, damn it. Okay, what about first aid? First aid skills won't help this poor Brahmin's broken leg. Ah, shit. Damn, that's too bad. Alright, let's head to the slaughterhouse then. Is there anything in... Oh, God. Uh, yep. See a dog. Cannot get there. see a gate. Is this a good dog or a wild dog? I think it's a good dog considering... See a dog. Oh, I can't talk to it. Well, I'm... obviously I can't talk to animals, but like... Can't even just see what's up. Damn. Okay. Well, I guess that's all the slaughterhouse has to offer. Let's head over to this building, huh? See what all is in here. See Baltha's wife. Okay, sniff. She crying or something? Hey, who's this guy down here? 
See a traitor. Okay. Sniff. Okay. Where is this Baltha then? Is he missing or something? God damn it, Vic. Why are you always getting in my way? Vic, can you get out of the way? Ooh, a chest. Sure, I'll take that. Wait, what? Wait, what? What happened to my inventory? What? Wait! What the fuck happened to my inventory? When the fuck did that happen? Did this motherfucker steal my inventory? What? Wait, 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 wait. What? Also, Vic, can you get out of the fucking way? God damn it, Vic. Okay, wait, what? Come on, get... Come on, god damn it, Vic, get the fuck out of the way. Uh, change our distance. Spread out a bit. Okay. Yeah, so get the fuck out of my way now. Vic. God damn it, where the fuck did my inventory go? Oh my god, Vic, move! Move, you asshole! Oh my god. You literally won't move, will you? Okay, there we go. Jesus Christ, you suck at getting in doorways. There's 101. But seriously, what the fuck happened to my inventory? Why is my inventory just fucking gone? Okay, I need to head back here and talk to this guy, because what the fuck? Okay, now who the hell is this guy? Don't know why I bothered to come here to trade. Okay, he's literally just a trader. Christian. Different people, different. Okay, yeah, you're just on that homophobic shit. Seriously, what the fuck? What happened to my inventory? See, golden gecko pelt. Oh! This is all my stuff. It's just on the floor. Why is it all... Oh, because I... Okay. Why do I have to pick things up individually? Okay. Okay, got my shotgun back. Yellow reactor card, okay. Damn, I have a lot of shit, don't I? 10 millimeter pistol, that's good. Got my shovel, got the rocks. Fix water flask. Am I encumbered or something? 
All right, here, let me try reading this. You learn nothing new. Damn it. Okay. Um, I'll equip these. See a spear. See money. Okay, yes, give me my money. Flare. See Davin. God damn it, Vic. Now you're standing on top of my shit. Oh my god, Sulik. Why do all my companions insist on standing in the middle of the fucking doorway? Jesus Christ, get the fuck out of the doorway! Now Vic is standing on my shit! God damn it! Sulik! Change our distance, stay close to me. Okay, there we go. Fucking finally. Oh my god, now I can't move at all. God damn it, Sulik. That's not what I meant. But heal yourself now. Change our distance. Spread out a bit. Sulik. Sulik, move. Move. Jesus Christ, why the fuck can't I move? Get the fuck out of my way. Oh my god! Alright, you two, get the... <sighs> Spread out, Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I can't move, you assholes! Why? Why the fuck won't you move? Get the fuck out of my way! Distance, you need a sack. <laughs> we are not. Oh my god, can you just. Oh my god, am I seriously gonna have to reload everything that happened because you assholes have blocked me into a corner and won't fucking move? Why the fuck won't you move? Jesus Christ! Oh, fuck you guys! Fuck you two! Fuck! God damn it! Man, fuck these guys! God! Fuck the companions in Fallout 1 and 2! God! They're always fucking trapping me in places! Now these two motherfuckers won't fucking move! Jesus! Fine! I'll reload fucking everything that I've just done. Fuck you two. Fuck you both. God damn it. <sighs> I'm sorry, that was a really angry rant. I'm just so, so mad that I have to redo everything that I've just done. Including killing these... Dogs. <sighs> All right. Let's do this again. Because fuck me, I guess. God damn it! Man, fuck Modoc. <laughs> this place sucks. <laughs> I'm doing this. I'm only bothering to do this again because there's some fucking good money in it. As long as I. 
I mean, $100 for every Brahmin kept alive, so... That's pretty damn good, if you ask me. And hey, maybe I'll be able to keep them all alive this time. Never know, though. We'll see. Hey, you actually hit one this time. Vic, way to go. So annoyed I have to do this all over again. If these companions weren't so useful in fights, well, if Sulik, Sulik is the only one that's actually useful in fights. But if companions in Fallout 1 and 2 in general, I mean all the Fallout games they're useful, but in these two in particular, they can really change the tide of battles depending on which ones you have and what you equip them with and whatnot. But man, sometimes I question whether it's worth it. Shit, and I'm out of ammo, of course. Okay. <sighs> okay. 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 Shit. This your first time, kid? All right, they're aiming out. They're aiming for this Brahmin, so gonna need to do something about that. Way to go, Vic! You're actually hitting them this time. Way to go! God damn it! Of course I hit the fucking Brahmin instead. Shit! Well, this one's definitely gonna die. Ouch! Yep, that one's dead. Okay. Hey, you killed one, Vic. Way to go. All right. Another one down. Yeah, that's right. Come after me now. And Vic. That's okay. You can go after Vic. That's okay with me. And gonna need to reload, huh? Yep, sure enough. Yep. But while I still can move, I will. Go Sulik. Pathetic. Hey, you're actually hitting them a lot this time, Vic. I'm, I'm proud of you. You know what? I'm not afraid to say it. You're doing a good job this time. Yeah, another one down. Haha, <laughs> another one down again. Ha 
Woohoo! Way to go, Suik! Alright. I think there's four left. Ah, thanks for the help, Vic. I'm proud of you. And, yep, out of ammo. Alright. Let's reload. Last two bullets make him count. Oh shit, I walked too close to that one. Ah, uh, you hit me, you asshole. And is this one dead? No, oh, maybe it is, maybe it's not. Either way. How did I miss? God, that's stupid. Oh shit, not looking too good. You shot the Brahmin, Vic, you dumbass. Alright, I don't want to take a chance. So I'm going to grab some stim packs and heal myself. Hey, alright, that one's running away now. Fuck, though, that's actually not too good, because... Gonna have to... Do the whole two-step chase after it thing. Shit, now it's running even more. Okay. And you hit me again, Vic. God, I'm almost dead because of you. And I'm out of ammo. So let me heal up again. And switch to the pistol. Hey, that one's running. Okay. I missed. Cool. All right. Awesome. Doing the whole... God damn it! Fuck! Okay, this part sucks. Let me see if I can just get out of combat. Nope. Cannot. Alright, cows be moving again. That's fun. And of course, you Brahmin get in my way. That's fun. And now it's running. Cool. Okay. Let's see. 5%. Oh, shit. There's one over here. Hey, got it. Not bad. Okay, come on, please don't tell me that's too close. If only these Brahmin would- God damn it! Of course it was. Shit. Uh. Excuse me. Oh my, oh wait, that one was alive too. Oh shit, I didn't even realize. Alright. 
Let's go for it. Missed. Damn it. And of course it's running. Cool. Okay, let's try. Missed, damn it. Okay, is it possible? God damn it. Why the fuck do I really, do I really ha why? Why do I have to kill all of them? They're running. All right, there's one down. Miss. Damn it. Miss again. And of course I miss again. God. Eleven percent. Hey, that's one that worked though. Not bad, all things considered. Okay, there's two more. Oh, all right, going right back into it again, huh? All right, there's one down. Alright, at least it's a little less annoying this time around. Still not great, but... Where's this? It's all the way over there. Fuck. Okay. Thank you, Brahmin, for getting out of the way. I do appreciate that. But now it's running. Of course. Let's see. 27. Shit. That was actually fairly good odds for what I've been dealing with. That kind of sucks. Negative 8%. All right. Miss again. God damn it. Oh shit, am I out of ammo? Shit, I am. God damn it. Okay. All right, thank God. Whew. Okay. I think that was all of them. At least, let me see. Yeah. Some Brahmin. Nope, yeah, that was all of them. Alright, thank God.
Now let's run back and let him know that nine of the Brahmin lived. Then I can get $900. And this time I'm going to not get shotgun wed. How about that, huh? Oh, God. All right, need to be able 100. All right, thanks, Pops. Pleasure doing business with you. All right, okay. We did it. Actually, let me check this bookshelf. Anything good in here? Ooh, some first aid and some flares. I'll go and take that. And I'm not about to go talk to either of these people. And before I do anything else, let me save. Alright, thank god. Never have to fucking do that again. Okay. Actually, let me... Let me reload. Let me read this book. There. Learn new ways to heal injury. Awesome. Yep, my first aid went up. It was at like 45% or something last time. 40 something for sure. Um, I already know this does nothing for me, so I'll just go ahead and sell that. Okay. All right, let's see here. Oh, yeah, the trader. Let's go talk to him. Yes, that's right. He is nothing. Townsperson. Another townsperson. Is there anyone in here now? There's another townsperson. A sink. I already know there's nothing in the slaughterhouse. I already know I can't heal this cow without better doctor stuff. Okay, let's head in here then. Yes, is it just you again? Altha's wife? Sob. Okay, she is not doing well. Let's see what you got in here, though. I'll go and take this money, though. And run out before I get caught in there again. Okay. It's right here it is. Take all that as well. Run out before the door. It's blocked. Nothing in there, okay. Alright, let's check out the tannery then. What all is in here? A heavy set man wearing a leather apron. Hello, my name's Balthus. Oh, I just ran into your wife. Why is she crank? I run the tannery here in Modoc. Can I help you? I'd like to see your wares. I'll be back later. I'm searching for an item called a Gek. Do you, by any chance, know anything about it or how I might obtain one? Sorry, I never heard of it. Okay. Any questions for you? I'd like to see your wares. Ooh, okay. You got a leather jacket, leather armor. Do you like that? And some monies. Well, I could use some armor, so... Let's see, 1265, shit. That's a lot, okay. But, got some of these, that's 500. Got some Psycho. Want any rocks by chance? Nope, they're worth nothing, never mind. Um, how about a Guns and Bullet magazine? Woo, 1325, all right. I'll take that. And 60 from you. There we go. That's a good trade. You're darn right it is. Darn tootin' right it is. Haha. <laughs> Damn, and I got 1176 now. Nice. Alright, just looking thanks. Okay. Let me go ahead and equip this armor while I'm thinking about it. Hell yes. All right. Looking much better now. 
the workbench. Ooh. Go and take that. It's a regular table. I see you got a border collie. Woof woof woof. Nice doggy. Woof woof woof. Uh Laddie jumps on you and starts to lick your face. What a nice doggy. Hey, that is a nice dog. Hell yes. Okay, anything else going on in this town? All those chimes ringing reminds me of a, a sound for like, uh, it's just a turlet. Let's see what's over here then. Reminds me of like a little like phone notification noises for people who have ring doorbells. It sounds exactly the same. Oh shit, there's a whole other part of town here. Yeah, that's right, the Ben breakfast. I forgot about that. All right. Let's check out what's in here first. All right, an old man. He makes a prune look fresh. Ooh, I didn't steal the watch, so stop coming over and harassing poor old Feral. Uh, watch, what are you talking about? Everybody is accusing me of stealing my best friend Cornelius's gold pocket watch. Me and Cornelius have been friends as long as I can remember. I would never take his watch. I searched everywhere, hoping to find it so we can be friends again, but I've had no such luck. Uh, I'll be around for a while. If I come across it, I'll let you know. Would you really? Nobody will help me because they think I stole the watch. It would be nice to have somebody on my side for once. I've already questioned everyone on it, but it won't hurt to ask everybody again. Maybe they'll tell you something they wouldn't tell me. It also wouldn't hurt to poke your nose around Rose's bed and breakfast. Cornelius is notorious for putting stuff down and forgetting where he put it a minute later. Can I ask you some questions? Can you tell me about Modoc. Modoc is a small community of farmers and ranchers. We supply most of the food for the surrounding towns and cities by trading our crops for various essentials. It's actually a very nice arrangement. However, this could all change with the trout. We can barely keep ourselves fed, let alone have surplus to trade. Um, what do you do around here? Well, mostly I put around in the garden trying to make those damn plants grow without water. Can't do that now because something big has moved in and I can't seem to get rid of it and to top it all off. Nobody will help me because they think I stole Cornelius's gold watch. Bet you stole the watch and I'll help. Nope, not gonna say that. I can help for a price. Uh, I'd be happy to help. That would be wonderful. I can't thank you enough. My garden is a little ways east of here. Come with me. I'll show you. Okay. Ah, some more rats. Oh, shit. I better get my gun out. Come at me, mole rats. And a regular rat, too, I guess. Damn! Way to go, Suleek. Minus 8%. Alright, let me head over here then. Take on this guy. Damn, that rat is still living after getting hit like that. Shoot! How did I miss? What? Let's see. All right, too far away, I guess. Hit for no damage? What? How the fuck was it hit for no damage? Alright, now the Morad is coming for me. God damn, that is a sturdy ass rat. Jesus. What the fuck? How did I miss? How the f What? Oh, 
Oh shit, I forgot I was so low on HP. Alright, finally, the rat's dead. And I'm poisoned somehow. How did I get poisoned? Alright. Hit it at least. Please don't hit me, Vic. Okay, good. How did I miss? All right, way to go, Sulik. Now, if only I can hit a damn thing. How the fuck do I miss? And how do you hit Sulik? Jesus. How am I still missing? How? Is the poison like fucking me up that much? Okay, finally. Hit for four points of damage. What the fuck? Oh my god, finally. Okay, leveled up. Let me... First... Go and take a poison antidote. There. It's 10 current poison level. Alright. And... Let me go and use the healing powder instead of stim packs. There we go. Lose one perception, but oh well, not the end of the world. There, reload now. Okay, let's keep on going. All right, they're coming back at me. I can take them. Thirty-seven percent, eleven, thirty-two. And shoot at the rat. Why are you still hitting Sulik, you dumbass? There we go. That's how you take care of a rat. Who let you in here? How did I miss? How the fuck am I missing these things that I have an 87% chance of hitting? It makes no goddamn sense! Oh my god, and I'm poisoned again. God damn it. Oh my god, I hit Sulik. Jesus Christ! Of course. Hey, that one's dead at least. Cool. Alright, I hit it for three points at least. Damn, why does my gun do no damage to these fools? Okay. Alright, let me... Load again. There we go. Okay. Okay. 
That was a very uh, courageous shot, Vic. Yeah, can I even check any of these? Nope. Yeah, you can't even check the bodies of the dead animals in this one. There we go. Ninety-five percent. That's better. But I still missed. How? How the fuck do you miss with a ninety-five percent chance? Hey, there we go. All right. Should you, all right. This looks like the last one. Just one wrapped. And we're good. There we go. All right. Hey, we got them all. Hell yes. Okay. Let's level up now. Ooh, yes. We get a new move. Bonus move. For each level of bonus move, you get two free APs each turn that can only be used for movement. In other words, you can use move two free hexes each turn. Ooh, okay. Adrenaline Rush. With this perk, you gain plus one to your strength when you drop below half your max hit points. A comprehension. Much closer attention to the small details when reading. You gain 50% more skills when reading books. Educated. For each level of educated, adds plus two skill points uh, when gaining a new experience level. Ooh, okay. That's actually good. I like that. Eve Ho. Plus two to strength. I'm a Sutra Master. Comes to pleasing sexually, you wrote the book. Magnetic personality. Get one extra slot to your companion limit. Uh, don't forget that more than five is always a crowd. Okay. Negotiator. Only you can barter with the best of them, but you can talk your way. Gain plus ten percent to both barter and speech. Presence, some initial reaction, pack rat, little extra. All right, yeah, let's go with educated. There we go. All right, yeah, educated plus two, swift learner. That's right. That's right. Also got bloody mess as a perk. Hell yes. All right, let's see. Let's uh, let's go ahead and put some into doctor. So hopefully I can help the cow. And lockpick, steel trap, science repair. Maybe let's try um. Maybe let's try first aid. Er, doctor. Without the skill, take much longer period of time to restore crippled limbs to use. <sighs> Alright, for now, let me go ahead and put all this into doctor. So hopefully I can better help that cow. There we go. Oh wait, run over here. Almost missed it. There we go. Damn, why didn't it show up on my uh, thing when I was looking for stuff? All right, it's dead. Gained 300 experience points. Damn, just for... Shit, okay. Anything else? Anything at all that I can see? Nope, I cannot see anything. Alright. I take it to mean I'm good then. Let's head on out. Go collect our bounty. Or not bounty, but... You know what I mean. Go talk to this guy.
Uh, now what? Cleared out all the vermin from your garden. Thank you. You are truly a hero amongst heroes. Not many people would risk their lives for a total stranger. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You get this warm, fuzzy feeling all the way down to your toes. Aw, oh, that's so sweet. Okay. Oh, so that's literally all I get. It's just, uh, some... Uh, it's just some good karma. Okay. I mean, I'll take it. Better than nothing, but... What the? Why can't I... The door closed behind me or something? Oh, yeah, it did. Why did it close behind me? Alright, thank God. Okay. Go see what's over here. It's probably just a turlet. See outhouse. See a wall. Oh, whoa, what the? Oh, what's this now? Oh, I cannot get past that. Explosive charge. Okay, I do not have any explosives. That's interesting. I'll have to come back. Now that I know that there's something in the crapper. Alright, let's go ahead and check out Rose's bed and breakfast. All right, see a townsperson, a trader, and a pleasantly plump woman. Welcome to Rose's Bed and Breakfast. My, aren't you the strapping young man? What can Rose help you with today? Start, what do you have to eat around here? You'd like a room for the night? You must hear things You must hear things working here. Mind if I ask you a few questions? Sorry, sweetie, I'm quite busy serving customers. Maybe if you ordered something, I'll have time to chat with you between orders. In that case, I'm starving. What do you have to eat? That's what I like to hear. A growing young boy needs to eat to keep up his strength. And I can tell you you haven't been eating and I can tell you haven't been eating properly. You just sit right down and look at the menu. Ooh, Brahmin fries, wasteland omelet, water. Water's a thousand. Whoo! Uh shepherd's stew. Alright, shepherd's stew is only three dollars, so I'll get that. She quickly disappears behind the counter, returns with your order. I ask you a few questions? Sure, but make it quick, dear. I don't want to keep the other customers waiting. Uh, what can you tell me about Cornelius? Er, have you ever heard of a Gek? Do you say Gek? No, I can't say that I have. I have heard of some good soup recipe that requires three Geckos, but no, I haven't heard of anything about a Gek. If you don't need anything else, I have other customers. Ask you a few more. Alright, let's order some more shepherd stew. Alright. Cornelius is missing watch. Oh dear, have you been talking to my husband, Cornelius? It's your husband now. Uh, this whole business with the watch is just terrible. Cornelius has got the whole town believing that his best friend, Farrell, took his watch. Uh, if you've talked to him, I'm sure you've noticed his mind isn't quite functioning properly. I'm pretty sure the poor deer just left the watch somewhere and forgot where. Okay. Alright, what do you have to sell by chance? Ooh, you got a deagle. But I don't really need it, so... Okay. Alright, goodbye. Old man. Okay, that's probably Cornelius. So let's see if I can go talk to him then. Welcome to Rose's Ben Breakfast. My name is Rose. I mean Cornelius. I run this Ben Breakfast. Can I help you? If you run this place, then how come it's called Rose's Ben Breakfast? I'm looking for a gold watch. What do you do here? Uh, how come it's called Roses? Rose is my wife. I named this place after her. Did, did you know I'm married? Um, looking for a gold watch. Why don't you ask that no good feral? Maybe he'll sell you the watch she stole from me. If you don't mind, I'm quite busy. I gotta shave the Brahmin. 
Alrighty, never mind then. Anything on this bookshelf by chance? Nope. God damn it, Vic. God damn it, Vic. Why are you always blocking? Vic, come on. Why? How do you always find the right place to stand to block the way? Um, stay close to me. There we go. Okay. Okay. All right, let's head on out here then. Actually, wait a second. Be a traitor. Okay. Be a bed. Okay, there's nothing out of the ordinary here then. Traitor. Stay away from the Brahmin fries. Those makes the best omelet. Life in Modoc is just slow. Just as slow, just the way I like it. Okay. So I need to come into the possession of some explosives, it seems. Greater townsperson. Another townsperson. Okay. Oh, some Brahmin pens. Let's see what's on this bookshelf here. Nothing. Okay. A chair. Oh, hello. See a scruffy little lad hard at work caring for the Brahmin. Hey, I'm still growing. I need my sleep. Oh, sorry, bud. Okay, lastly, let's try over here then. Whoa, what the? Dogs seem to be trained to protect what's inside the shed. Huh. That is also secured with a pile of rocks. Interesting. Used to be a prosperous farming town. Okay, well, seems I need to get some explosives to do this last thing here in town that I seem to be able to do. Otherwise, it's going to wrap it up here. All right, so let's see what all can I buy. back here I forget what he had for sale oh that's right he didn't really all right Is there anything in here you yeah, well Okay, no way to get into it, apparently. Alright. Not gonna talk to him about a Gek, because I know not to do that. Oh. Well, they get all the way around. Oh, there's a back door. Alright. Let's barter with him. Oh, he does have explosives. Okay. How much is one? Oh, it's a thousand! Okay, and sell him that for 200, maybe some BBs, 160, okay, okay, um, some Radix, okay, 
Maybe uh, some flares. How much do all of them cost? 945, okay, okay. Looking promising. 945. All right, how about we say these worth anything? Nope, okay. How about this? Nope, okay. All right, let's just say 945 plus 55. Make it the even a thousand. There we go. Okay. Don't suppose you have a gold watch for sale? What, are you trying to be a wise ass? Everyone knows old uh, Corny lost his gold pocket watch. He even had me search his best friend's house looking for it. If you know what's good for you, you'd keep your nose out of this. Good day. Alrighty then. Have anything interesting on your bookshelves? What are you doing? Hey, leave that alone. How about this. Ooh, take some more flares. Anything on here though that you can let me look at? Nope. Okay. All right. So I'm guessing something valuable is right there. All right. So let me save. I'm going to try and do steal on this. Thief. Yep, that's why I saved. Let's reload that. Let me, out of curiosity, I'm going to try again. Nope, all right, he just knows. My steel is not good enough. Alright. What if I try stealing from him directly? By chance, would that work? Okay. I try taking the ammo. Damn it. Nope. Alright. Never mind, not gonna try, not gonna try. Don't worry. Okay. With all that, let's head back. And go blow up this porta potty. Now I'm curious what's in it, what that giant rat god is doing back there. Okay. Yeah, let's do one minute. Okay. Oh man, oh, there is shit everywhere! Whew! It flew all around. Man, I just went for duck and cover on that. You made it out of the hole just in time for the explosion to go off behind you, sending you flying through the air. Ah, okay, okay. That's funny. <laughs> like some action movie shit. Boop! All right, let's head back down. Damn, there really is a lot of shit in here, huh? Or, well, there was. <laughs> oh, shit. The rat god is coming. Can't hit him from here. Cool. Sixty percent. And I miss. Awesome. Hey, Vic missed too. What do you know? Hey, hit him that time. That's good. Shh. 
shit, I keep on forgetting to heal myself before getting into this stuff. All right, let me go ahead and heal. There we go. At least I got some armor on me, so that's good at least. All right. You want to help me out at all, companions? Nope, just me and the rat. Cool. All right. Vic moved one spot. Are they like frozen or something? Like what's going on with them? And I miss. Eighty two, okay. Come on, Sulik. You're not, not gonna help me out here at all, bud. Okay, seriously, what the hell happened to my companions? Gonna need to heal. While I'm healing, might as well reload. Okay. Only 10 points, that's not good. It's better. That's not good. At least I didn't. Uh, what? Oh shit! I got knocked onto my feet because of that. All right. Oh. Okay. Never mind. Thought Sulik was gonna do something. Nope. He just took some steps. He just. He needed to get his step count in for the day. Oh. Are they finally going to be doing something? Nope, they're just walking around. They're just following me. Guys, can you... Can you help out at all? Even a little? Even a little bit would be great. Seriously, anything, anything at all would be amazing. Alright, thank god it missed. Okay. Alright, thank god. Whew! Alright. Saved on that one. Alright. What all were you hiding in here, huh? Crash, some busted pipes, half burst in the dirt, nothing important to see here, move along. Oh, Cornelius' gold watch, oh shit, that's where it was. And some fruit, interesting. Anything else in here? Nope, okay, all right. Oh, they're both hurt. Is that why they didn't help out in the fight? Both too hurt to do so. Okay, well, hey, we got the watch and that's awesome. And even though it didn't end up counting in the long one, one run, I did technically get shotgun married. So, hey, at least there is that too. All right, let's, uh, let's go return the watch to Cornelius then.
Alright. Hello, Thar. Have we met? Um, I found your watch at Pharaoh's house. You were right. Pharaoh is the thief. Uh, no, I'm not going to say that. It seems an industrious rat made off with your watch. I recovered this from its nest. That's my watch. What are you doing with that? Give it back. He snatches the watch from your hands. I think you better go. We don't... What? What? That's gratitude for you. Okay, alright. Fuck that guy, then. At least I got some XP out of it. And I got some experience points, so that's good, too. Alright, I'll go let him know, at least. Uh, now what? Can you tell me... Okay, he just doesn't care anymore. Alright, good to know. Okay. Well then, let's go see if we can't help out this sick cow. And I think we're going to be done here once we help out this poor cow. Or if we can, that is. All right, let's try doctor. You failed to, God damn it, even with all that, really? 59% isn't good enough. Oh, hey, it worked the third try. Hell yes. You see, Bess. Moo. Hell yeah. Got some XP for that, too. Ain't that good stuff. Okay. Well, that is pretty darn good, all things considered. Let's reload. And let's also... Rest until the full party is healed. Well, hey, that was pretty good all around. All things considered, that ended up doing pretty darn good for everyone. You feel very nauseous. Uh, you should heal yourself now. Boss, they got me good. You've got to get me to a doctor. You should heal yourself. Mostly healed. I've been better. Mostly healed up. I've been, but I've been better. Okay. What you be needing? You. Okay. All right. Sounds like he needs a doctor's bag. But can't really get that for him right now. So. I'm just going to rest till I'm healed then, and then we'll continue on to Vault City and probably call it there because I spent way too long here because of so many things fucking up. <laughs> so that's been fun. Um, but hey, you know, in the end, we did it. We got it. We got it done. And we did everything that we needed to do here everything that we want to do here for now at least so let's head on over to vault city every time i play this game i forget just how slow you move on the world map in this one compared to fallout 1 it's insane honestly <laughs> oh hey it's pretty close by cool not too bad, not too bad. Vault City. Oh, and there's something unknown right by it too. Okay, okay, okay. That's good to know. Oh, we have an encounter here. Oh, what the? Time to weed out more outworld or trash. See a patrol guard. Okay, so there's patrol guards. There's slavers. Ooh, yep, okay. Let's uh 
Let's help them take out the slavers then. Try not to damage the merchandise. Degenerate filth. Sulik was hit for 65 points. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You killed Sulik. What the fuck? God damn it. Fuck. I can't lose Sulik. Fuck. I forgot to save. Fuck, where does that put me now? God damn it. Okay, I need to go kill this mole rat again. Fuck! I thought I was almost done. God damn it. Ugh. My inability to remember to save at convenient times continues to screw me over in this game. God damn it. Alright. Nope. Well, before I head down there, let me at least heal. Before I go face this mole rat. So that way, hopefully, I don't have to use any stim packs while I'm down there. Okay. All right. Let's get this back out. One minute should do. Shit everywhere. Made it out of the hole just in time for the explosion to go off behind you, sending you flying through the air. Alright. That all taken care of, let's head back down. Head back down the crapper hole. Funny that I get 500 experience points just for blowing up an outhouse. <laughs> Alright, let's reload. Let's go take on this mole rat bitch. Alright, and hopefully my companions will help me out this time. One can hope, at least. Hey, they're running in. Okay. Hey, there we go. Ah, oh, shit, are they not helping out again? God damn it, why? Why, guys? Come on. Vic even shot at it once. Why won't it... God damn it. Alright, good to know. It's just... For some reason, it's this fight. They just refuse to help out in it. Cool. Thanks, guys. Thanks for being my companions and all. All right, at least I'm doing some good damage to the mole rat. Some decent damage, I should say. It's not hitting me too bad. That's good. Let's just keep it up. And it hit, knocked me down, so means I won't have enough AP to 
do any to, to actually be able to shoot it this time. So, okay. All right. Shoot it again. Shit, out of him. God damn it. All right. Go and grab some healing powder. I'm at it. Reload. Okay. Shoot at it again. Hey, hey, there we go. Perfect, perfect. All right. Go get the gold watch. And there's some fruit down here. Where was it? There it is. All right. Hey, got some fruit too. Nice. Okay. Let's head back up. And I'm going to go ahead and talk to uh, Cornelius, or not Cornelius, uh, this guy first, about the recovered watch. See what he says. Uh, now what? Is this the watch you were looking for? Let me see that. Yes, this is it. You said a rat living down the sewer hole stole it? You climbed down there and retrieved it? Ew, I'm gonna give this cord to Cornelius right now. Now we can be friends again. Thank you. Alright, hey! Uh, you have peacefully solved the feud between Farrell and Cornelius. Oh, hey, okay, that was actually a better resolution now. Awesome! Oh, and the door. Oh. Didn't even notice that bookcase there. Well, there was nothing on it anyway. I want to open this door because for some reason, doors seem to love to just shut behind you for no reason whatsoever. So that's fun. And let's head on back to go heal this cow. And then we'll save. And then head to Vault City. Because... Yeah, I just love to screw myself over by not saving in this game, huh? Still... Let's try again. Hey, hey, there we go. 200 XP. Perfect. All right. Now that we're here, first, let's rest until healed again. And then save. Definitely not about to walk out of this city without saving. Learn that lesson once the hard way, not about to learn it again. Save. There we go. Okay, game saved. How close am I? Oh, I'm still like 3,000 away. Okay. Alright, now let's head to Vault City. Now let's do it. Okay. Finally. Finally, finally, finally heading over. Slowly but surely. Making our way downtown. I don't remember the rest of the words to that song, but that's okay. Oh, alright. Ah, okay. Run into slavers, or robbers in this case. But there's no patrol guards with machine guns here. So that's okay. You hear some sounds coming from within the cave. Interesting. Loser. Damn, okay.
You ready, bitch? What? Where did they get to go again? Alright, there we go. Hey, hey! Got him! Damn! Alright. Gonna have to take care of these guys with the guns first. This is my favorite job. Alright. Got some hits on him. That's good. Vic is out of ammo for the pipe rifle. Oh shit, he finally had to switch to uh, the gun I gave him a while back. Okay. Take... Another two steps forward. Shoot at this guy again. God damn, that hurts. Everybody, it's target practice. Alright, really need to do something about uh, this rifle guy before it does too much damage to Sulik. So, let's go ahead and shoot at them. Okay. Shit. Maybe that was a bad idea. 56%. 95. Alright. Okay. Not looking too good for me, huh? Alright, let's see. Let's, um... Let's go ahead and use this healing powder on myself, then. And shoot at them. There we go. Alright, Sulik is... Hurt enough to need to take a break. Understand that, but also... Shit. That's why we saved. Okay. You have died. Well, good thing we saved recently, so... Man, who knew that, uh... Getting to Vault City would be just as deadly as... All the rest of <laughs> this part so far. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Why the fuck is this <laughs> equally as hard as trying to get all the rest of the shit in Modoc to work right? <laughs> God damn. Man, I mean, I, I know, like... Ah, oh, shit, again... Oh, god damn it. Okay, slavers and patrols. Okay, we're not in the middle of them. So we should be able to just shoot from afar. And I missed, of course. You animal! Try not to damage the merchandise. Alright, Sulik, please, for the love of God, don't get killed by these guys on accident again.
Alright, okay, thank god you're not getting caught in the crossfire yet. This is what we do to vermin. God damn it, why'd you. Shit. Okay. Got that one. That one seems to be down now. Degenerate filth. Okay. Let's try now. Damn it. Fuck. Alright, at least he was hit for no damage. What? Oh, shit. Did I hit him too many times? God damn it, this was going so well, too. Shit. Damn, you popped a goddamn lung. Alright, let's take out the one with the machine gun, at least. Fuck, this isn't gonna go well. God damn it. This was going well, too. Shit. Well, if we're able to kill them, at least we should be able to get some good weapons off them. That's a big if. All right, going in for the melee now. Shit. I have one health. Let me go ahead and use it. And I can still shoot this guy. Awesome. All right. At least the machine gun is machine gunners seem to be out of ammo. Oh shit, I'm not looking good. Let me... One of those and reload while I'm at it. Alright, heal up again. See if I can't get this guy to shoot his own... Nope, okay. Oh, hey, alright. Also out of ammo, perfect. Alright, they're just going in for melees now. That's all good, that's all good. Ooh. Okay. Alright. Keep focusing on this guy. Your mama teach you that move. Damn. Crack some ribs, all right. <laughs> okay, that one seems to be down. Maybe not dead, but down at least. Ready to go, Suleek. Maybe you can come help me out soon, then. How did I miss? Jesus Christ. Why'd you go and have to do that? God damn. Ow, my spleen. Oh, for no damage? What the fuck? Come on. How you get hit for no damage, asshole? Where's your mama now? Hit for... What? How are my shots doing no damage? What the fuck?
How is Vic doing more damage against them than me? Alright, let me try... I'm gonna try something wild here. Let me try breaking out the spear. Nope. Okay. Let me try healing myself then. And taking one step. for no damage cool awesome so great my god for three points okay okay hey i did some damage there that's good that's good it's gonna be a long fight though i guess we're just in for it oh great and they have stim packs too oh god Vic is out of ammo, now he's going for melee attacks? Oh, Jesus Christ, we're really screwed here, huh? And I wonder if I should just reload and call it an audible on this. <laughs> I mean, Sulik still has not killed this one, and they've been going at it for a while. Ah, uh, Jesus. And I miss again. Cool. I think I'm just gonna reload. This is taking just too damn long that it's not worth it. Alright. Let's try this again. Jesus Christ, I hope I don't have to run across any more of those assholes. I just want to get to Vault City. Why is the game making it this hard? Jesus. Oh my god. Ugh. Man, I feel like with this game, they just... They are like, the last one? That was too easy. We need to... We really need to screw people over more with this game. Alright, it's just slavers this time. Just slavers. That should be easy enough. Let's just not die here now. Okay, hit that one. go oh 
shit. That one has a submachine gun. All right, way to go, Vic. Yep. Shoot at this guy now. So he has a submachine gun, and that's not okay. Ha! Shot your own person first before you shot me. That makes you a dumbass. There we go. Ooh, okay. Maybe I need to heal. God damn it, why'd you shoot Su Leak, you dumbass? Heal myself up a bit. And shoot this motherfucker again. Okay, go ahead and run, Suli. That's, uh... I'm okay with that. As soon as I catch my breath, <coughs> I'm coming for you. Alright, he's out of ammo. That's good. Just gotta go... Oh shit, Sulik is dead. God damn it! Fuck, why is it so fucking hard to get to Vault City? Without something like this happening. Jesus Christ! I just want to get to Vault City! How is this now the hardest part of the game? What the fuck? God damn it! I just want to get... What? Some homeless people? No! I'm not stopping to look at homeless people. Just get me to fucking Vault City. God. Oh. Oh my pack of wild dogs. No. Just let me continue. Oh, come on! Now it's geckos? What the fuck? What the fuck? God damn it. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Why? Why the fuck did the game decide to hate me this round? Like seriously, what the fuck? At least the geckos don't seem to be doing much to us, so that's good. And as long as they don't fully eviscerate us, then I can get some pelts out of them. Jesus Christ! Alright, that's one down, so that's good. One down, four to go. Okay.
84 percent or 87 Go with the 87 percent chance Okay. League seems to be taking care of this one, so. Okay, never mind. Alright. Alright, another one down. Three more to go. Okay, three down. Just these two left. Let me reload. Oh, I was exactly out of ammo there. Perfect, now I'm not. Oh, okay. Alright. Take the pain, motherfucker! <laughs> Damn, okay, Vic. We need to talk some shit on these geckos. So far, it's looking okay. Okay, okay, okay. Still alive, not great, but not terrible. Why'd you shoot me, Vic? I know you missed, but still, what the fuck? Probably should have moved out of the way, but oh well. Oh, Vic is out of ammo. He's gotta, he's gotta go for the melee attacks. You brave bastard! All right, another one is down. Let's reload once again. Okay, I missed somehow though. That's interesting. Aw, so Luke's glaring at me again. I missed. How? How did I miss again? God. Alright, I'm gonna have to use another stim pack, I think. Yep. I just keep on missing. Feel the burn. Yeah, talk shit on him, Vic. God damn it. Oh my god. How do I miss so much? This is honestly a bit ridiculous. That's a bleeder. God damn it. 
Wow, I suck with this gun, apparently. Uh, uh, for no damage? What the fuck? How? How the fuck does a bullet not do damage to you? What the fuck? And I miss again, Jesus Christ. Oh my God, we all just miss. It's just nothing but us missing the entire goddamn time. All right, I'm breaking out spear then. Just doing that, because maybe maybe I'll have a better chance with a spear against this. Oh wait, is it dead? Okay, thank God it's dead. All right, let's take the pelts. So now at least we can get some money from all this. All right, thank God. Is there anything in this tent? Bed, a rug, okay, nothing worthwhile. All right, let's heal up and continue on to Vault City then. Oh, Jesus Christ. At least we finally lived. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. And I'm gonna go ahead and save. Since I'm closer to Vault City now than I ever have been, and I'm five gecko, golden gecko pelts richer. Okay, and it remembers I'm continuing on to Vault City. Chosen, the Whoa. spirits of our ancestors guide me to a world of dreams that I may touch thoughts. What the? Our village suffers without the holy geck. Your hands hold our lives as a father holds his children. Whoa. That was weird. Oh, god damn it. Alright, we're just, we're leaving this. We're not even getting involved. Big Sulik, get the fuck out of their way. Yeah, there we go, Sulik. Vic, come on, bud. If you die, I'm not reloading for you. You're not worth it. Alright, way to go, bud. Now let's just get the fuck out of here. Not, not even bothering with these assholes. There we go. Alright. Come on. Let's just get to Vault City. Just please, for the love of God, let's get to Vault City. Right. Hey, we made it. Thank fucking God. Okay. All right. First of all, go ahead and 
put away my weapons first. Actually, go and keep my gun holstered. There. I'm not about to walk in here. I'm going to pick back up with a weapon. So now, all that set aside, let me save again because I'm here. All right. Okay. All right. We finally made it to Vault City. We finally completed all this shit with Modoc and just trying to get to the goddamn city. Jesus Christ. That was way more frustrating than it should have been. I just realized there are turrets all over this place. That's fucking cool. Okay. All right. The madness is over. Thank God. Oh, man. Ah, that was frustrating, but we did it, and that's the important part. So, thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you had a fun time, because it sure was a time to be had. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment, ring the bell, all that good stuff. And I'll see you next time for on another Retro Gaming Monday.